When the Breeders' Cup team decided to bring the World Championships back home to Keeneland, the Lex Arts Board of Directors didn't think twice. Having seen phenomenal success in its first two iterations, a third installment of Horse Mania was a natural fit. However, just as the popular public art project was taking shape, the COVID-19 pandemic created a full stop and Horse Mania 2020 was a late scratch. With Breeders' Cup fast approaching, Lex Arts made a quick spin and created a unique opportunity to partner in the Painted Horse Trilogy. Breeders' Cup, Keeneland and Maker's Mark have joined forces to bring this phenomenal public art project to the starting gate and across the finish line. Three full-size fiberglass horses have now become extraordinary works of art. These iconic sculptures celebrate our shared history and hope for the future and will greet Breeders' Cup guests in downtown Lexington and at the Breeders' Cup World Championships at Keeneland. When there was an opportunity to celebrate horse racing, celebrate the local arts and partner with two long-term partners of the Breeders' Cup, Makers Mark and Keeneland, it was a no-brainer. We are pretty creative organizations. We've done some really fun things together in the past. What we're proud of today is that we can use the success and some of our most important partnerships to give back to society and to celebrate the arts in a way that we and all of us in Kentucky can be proud of. It's just a really wonderful moment that I know our entire team and the teams at Keeneland and Breeders' Cup can all be really proud of. We hope people look at this as that. Each one of these pieces of art is going to be unique. Each one of them is going to be unique to, to our organizations and kind of what we represent. I was very excited because there were many people interested in, in this project. And since I came to Kentucky, I always asked myself, well, uh, how can I be part of this project? Uh, but I never did that research, so I think I'm very excited to, to be selected as one of the finalists and then now be part of something I always admire for so many years. I was inspired uh, for this piece. Uh, I was inspired in the Breeders' Cup Garland. There is so much beauty in, in plants and flowers and animals so important in our life and and sometimes we have a, a life that is so um, that life goes so fast that we don't see beauty in nature i'm honored to work and collaborate with the breeders cup uh, makers mark and kinland as they're all uh, kentucky staples i always admire the work they're doing here in kentucky the title of the horse is kinland 2020 and my sponsor Arkeelan. It's a scroll design over this horse first and uh, when I finish the whole airbrush uh, process what I'm doing right now it's right there I got a sketches over there I don't know if you want to take a little look maybe have idea what I'm doing. This one is gonna be very special because uh, in some way I did dream about it do, doing a commission for, for Keeneland, and uh, I'm just, I just feel great. Thank you, Lex Arts. Thank you, Keeneland. Um, I'm just honored to do this. This has been a fun project. I submitted an idea to Lex Art for it, and then I got approved to do the project, and it's for Maker's Mark. So, I have to then find out what was it that they wanted particularly to represent with this horse. And they are right now doing some fabulous research programs with solar panels, but also research about how to grow sustainably the white oak, which is the tree, the, the wood that you use for the barrels. Then they also wanted to have the color of bourbon, which of course makes sense. So I was very happy to work with that one and that's built up with lots and lots of layers of oil glazing to get that kind of rich tone. Then the other idea is they make a smart use their own water from lakes they have at the properties. And it's interesting, all of us artists, we are 
for foreigners in the country. I mean, I've been here a long time, but, but I'm from Sweden and I know they are from other countries. So that's kind of a fun little thing too, I think. And of course, a body of a horse is a slightly different surface than a flat surface that I work on the table. So that was kind of the challenge. Our horses are art. The horses themselves, the majesty of the horse, the beauty of a horse, the racing, the muscles, the everything that happens with a horse, a horse represents art. Horse racing itself is um, not only about racing, but the beauty and athleticism of these special thoroughbreds. It's also a lifestyle event celebrating the life of racing. And so anytime we compare art with the thoroughbred, I think it's a fantastic experience. This culmination of the Breeders' Cup celebrating Keeneland is not just a really wonderful partnership that many of us in Kentucky can be proud of, but we're able to come together for a higher purpose and cause and to support the arts. The arts bring people together and they allow us to, to celebrate beauty. The arts are uplifting and they provide hope and they provide uh, so much for people. It's a part of who we are. Because we know when we all work together in times like this, great things can be accomplished. But also importantly, in times like this, where we all need to come together, there will be an auction. And it's naturally fitting that that auction will occur at Keeneland. So these three horses will be auctioned, the proceeds will be donated to Lex Arts. Let's support their success and their inspired creativity in a way that will set up the next generation and you know, raise money for the creative forces that could be successful through this partnership. Now is your opportunity to capture the ultimate Breeders' Cup 2020 keepsake. Each of these horses is entered as a separate lot in Keeneland's Sporting Art Auction to be held virtually on Sunday, November 22nd. Based on the success of the Sporting Art Auction, as well as prior Horse Mania auctions, demand for these masterpieces will be strong. For more information on the Painted Horse Trilogy, including how to register for the Sporting Art Auction, please visit lexarts.org support trilogy.